right, you're going to need to choose any pan size that you want. I am using a 10 inch and a 5 inch and any decorating toys that you want to use. You will also need any cake flavor that you want. I'm doing the bottom layer as a chocolate and the top layer is carrot because that's my dad's favorite and this cake is for him. You will need M&Ms, Kit Kats, and icing. You will need to grease and flour your pans very well. Once your pan is greased and floured very well, preheat your oven to 325 for gas and 350 for electric. However, this is a 10 inch cake pan. It's gonna take about a one and a half cake mixes. So you may wanna do it at 325 for an hour. I'm sorry, for a little bit longer than you normally would because you want it to cook evenly. Now all you do is make up your cake mix. Okay, I am going to start it at 30 minutes and I'm going to check it at that and then rotate it. Okay, this is what it looks like at 26 minutes and it's still, I'm trying to shake the, it's still really wobbly in the middle. So I'm going to go ahead and flip it around and cook it for another 25 and see. All right. I just took it out, so 50 minutes for my oven at 325 was good. And it springs back and the toothpick came out clean. So we'll let it cool for a few minutes in pan and then we're gonna take it out. Okay guys, this cake has completely cooled. And all I am doing is spreading the icing on the top of it so I can put them two together. So you just want to, and I'm trying to make the edges a, um, the cake a little bit thicker because I don't want the top layer to split and crack. So I'm kind of pushing all the icing to the edges. And then we'll put them together. Okay, one very important tip once you have your cakes together is your Kit Kats must stick up, I want mine that much more, to hold the M&Ms in. So I am going to trim this top layer of cake just a little bit. I did not have to trim it. What I was actually able to do is just smush it down um, a little bit and that, that actually worked. So now all I'm doing is going around into the creases of the two layers oh, there's my other cake ready and I am making it even all the way around now I am just going to start putting the Kit Kats along the side as straight as I can and I'm going to do that all the way around well I've got all the Kit Kats around it and now I'm putting the M&Ms just in there and I'm going to put them all the way around. Yeah. Alright, I'm done. I think if I did anything else, I would put a ribbon around the Kit Kats. But I think it's absolutely cute. 